I'm Tom. I'm married to Charlotte from Nottingham and I have Duchenne muscular dystrophy, which is a serious and progressive muscle wasting disease. I'm Charlotte. I've been with Tom for two years and we got married this August. I'm from Nottingham and I've got a progressive neuromuscular disease. Your sex life. Yeah, so there's quite a few different aspects to our sex life that I can can bring to your attention. One of the main things we use to help us have sex is the hoist. Basically all it involves is me or Charlotte getting into the sling and getting hoisted over the top of each other. Our hoist at home only goes has buttons to go up and down, but the one on our honeymoon remote had like buttons to go left and right yeah. as well. And it was kind of like a, a, like a scene from Wallace and Gromit, where like I was just kind of in the sling going backwards and forwards and up and down, and like I just couldn't find the right buttons, and just legs kind of like going everywhere. And <laughs> it, yeah, it was quite quite a scene. I think I mean what helps us. I think you probably agree is that our PA is having a sense of humour. Especially when we call them in and like, yeah. I'm sort of like sitting on your face and like you're suffocating. And I think that accidental innuendos from PAs yeah. make us laugh all the time and just having that general ability to laugh at those things opens up our confidence and our ability to communicate yeah. with them about sex and intimacy. It takes a lot of relationship building before you can say, <laughs> Helen, could you put Tom in my sexy knickers, please? <laughs> it's amazing when you... Uh, you have that relationship that you can do that and you can feel free to do that with your PAs because you know sex is a is a is a health and well-being need like as far as we're concerned get more from the open university check out the links on screen now